Hello dudes and dudettes, welcome back to All The Mods 9. Guys, we got some fun stuff planned for today. Uh, last episode we kind of dove into some neural networks. If you guys missed that episode, I highly recommend checking it out. But I've been messing around with these hydroponic beds from Industrial Foregoing. And they're pretty good. Um, we're going to be doing a lot with these guys today. So I wanted to test these out with the uranite seeds we have. And as you can see, they're going pretty quickly. Uh... Yeah, they're growing really fast, but we do need to put ether gas in here. And so that's what we're gonna be working on today um, is setting up a system so that we can craft up a bunch of these guys. Um, yeah, because I wanna get a couple of those going uh, because that'll be great. So the ether gas, I believe allows it to harvest itself. Um, yeah, so let's look here, ether. Ether gas here is from a laser drill. Uh, fluid laser base person to do the laser drill. Yeah, so we need a simple machine frame. Um, we're actually gonna need quite a few of these. So it might not be the worst idea in the world to craft up as many of these items as we can. Okay, so I think we should make a stack of these guys. So what I got here, is a simple chest. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna place it like this here. And then we're gonna do one of those. We'll even put this here. And then we're gonna do the recipe for this guy, like so. And then we're gonna lock it in. And then we're gonna take all these items and do a little bit of that. And input. Hmm. Okay. Oh, whoops. Maybe it needs to be on the top. Okay, so we made four. There's no way of like putting it in here. I tried to have it set to pull from that side, but for some reason it doesn't seem to work. Uh, so if you guys know how to do that, let me know down in the comment section because that's, that's a bit frustrating. I was hoping that would work. I guess I should have tested it, my fault. Um, but we got a couple of these guys. So let's see, laser drill. We can create that ether gas and we need purple ah here we go so we need latex we need some of that and then i guess we could just do the purple one right purple dye yeah and then some of this one two three four is that it that sure is okay so these four up here and then purple dye that gives us purple laser lens very cool Okay, so we need to upgrade already. So we need some netherite. Um, we need plastic, obviously. That's the top ones. We need gold. I'm gonna process this stuff up here real quick. Good. We need gold, and then we need diamond gear. Okay. All right, we got it. So here is our advanced machine frame. So that allows us to make a stasis chamber. We need that to hold the uh, wither in it. Okay, so we're gonna get a flux point. And I think the laser drill needs something, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's one of these, an ore laser base. Oh, we need all the modium. Oh boy. Okay. Well, time to put this laser to good use i'll be right back i'm gonna go into the all the modium dimension the mining dimension here and we will have a good time okay we got our first all the modium here so just going to use our vibranium fortune five pickaxe got a total of five we can double those which is good and we will uncover our all the modium okay we got one, that's good. Okay, so we got a total of 13. So we're gonna use our ore hammer on these guys. Um, there it is. There we go, so now we got 26. Perfect, all right. And then I believe, okay, I guess I don't know. Oh wow, that's gotten expensive. Okay, so now we have ourselves an Automodium pickaxe. And we need, oh, vibranium gears. Wow, okay. Hmm. 
So I need to go back to the other and kind of loot that place up a bit. Um, so I've got a Vindicator Charm and an Evoker Charm that we are going to use. Is there a Charm Necklace that we can get? We're going to bring in some Night Vision. Okay, let's go to the other. Okay, we're in. So we can kind of loot here. Oh, a little bit of lag spike. The only thing we have to worry, out, worry about is the Wither Skeletons. But these guys can't see us. Which is good, which means we have no Vex, which is very good. These guys can't see us. What was that? Spirit Orb, interesting. Oh. Oh, I totally missed him. Well, he's somewhere. Okay, we got ourselves some Vibranium, very good. We'll take some Olivamodium as well. Mystical Enlightenment, we'll need that. Okay, more Vibranium, very good. Whoa, this is the room I've never found before here. Oh, what? Oh, geez. Well, that... Interesting. So there's just blocks of netherite just chilling. There's three blocks of netherite just chilling. Oh, and a block of diamond. Oh, lava. Uh, I think I catch on fire. What do I lose? We don't need stone. We got plenty. Um, time to start putting some stuff in here. What? It's fake lava. Okay. What? Oh, I've got all the modium on. That's funny. Shay. Oh, a new Volker. Ah, chest. That's lots of gold, peeps. Yes, the vibranium. I would like a stack before we leave looting okay more space that was a good room yes we got a full stack of vibranium let's go wait oh, the skellies might poop me oh look at this another one. Oh no the cool netherite blocks are gone but i will take the vibranium for sure and all the modium Ooh, stable footing we need that on our boots that negates the uh the penalty for flying and trying to mine something. Okay, so I think we got enough of the resources. <laughs> um, yeah, we were sitting pretty good. So I think we're gonna have over a stack of things. A stack of all our, a stack of all the modium ingots, nothing too crazy. Yeah, then we can turn these. Look at that, over a stack, that's so cool. Okay, and then we need the vibranium, 123. And then we still got some left over, good. Okay, so there's the vibranium gears, ore, ore, base. We need iron ore, huh? And then we also need this. I'm gonna take these materials and we'll craft up one of these. All right, we got this advanced machine frame crafted. Now I need to silk touch some iron ore. I can go do that. I think I know where some is. Why well, just in this hill over here? There we go. Okay, so now we have everything for the ore laser base, which is what we need. Yep, okay. Stasis chamber, laser drill, this guy. We need some energy pipe conduit pipe thing. We're gonna take one of these guys, an ultimate. Okay, we got ourselves a flux point. Good. So, okay, so I believe the stasis chamber goes beneath here. Yep. Perfect. That's where we're gonna have that guy. And then the laser drill base goes here with the laser drill on top nope i think i think these are reversed yeah because that says base no i just did that and then oh yo what are you doing up here and we're going north okay so i think if we give this power now it should theoretically work so let's try it Okay, and we'll just go something like this, and oh, like that. 
make sure it can pull power out fast enough. Oh, I was in the stasis chamber, so that guy's working. Maybe I do need to flip these guys. Okay, so the base is here. Oh, oh, I guess. Let's try it out. We can build a wither in there, and they shouldn't shouldn't get out. I mean, the stasis chamber is always going to be powered, so we should theoretically be okay. Hmm. Famous last words. Oh, here, here, here. Oh, he's not. Jet There's no bar. Oh, it's working. I think I need to do some research real quick. Okay, so this is actually the one we need that is significantly cheaper. Um, so I'm going to build this guy real quick. We need the fluid, even though it's ether gas. Um, oh, not that way. Okay, and then we need the fluid base. Good. Okay, so we've got it set up. So the laser drill is pointing that way and is pointing downward. Uh, we're going to have to redo a little bit of this nothing too crazy so now these are good to go I mean technically we could just leave that there and if we do that this should give us something when this progress bar goes through hmm the laser drill is pointed hmm okay so we've got it producing ether gas I did have to go ahead and um, mine it and place it but yeah now we're getting ether gas here um i did move it closer to it see if that was the problem and i think it was so now we're good to go and we can close that in i had a wandering trader wander in there he was definitely wandering right into the thing with the wither not sure why anybody would want to wander in there but now i'm going to make some ender tanks and we're going to make a new channel here we need some diamonds somehow my my achievements got reset so it's a little weird uh can you make the storage in these guys bigger is it like this yeah tank capacity yeah that's cool okay so those have been upgraded and ether gas is kind of gray so i do have quite a bit of ink sacks so we're just gonna go triple triple gray for the ether gas so we're gonna set one up uh nope i guess yeah we can just put it there wade is it gonna work let's try it then so that is on the north side I'll put north push. There we go. It just needs to be on its side like that. And so now we should theoretically be able to do this. And we get ether gas. Yes, it's farming itself and planting. This is what we needed. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Look how fast it's generating this. This is awesome. So we've got ether gas automated. We've got uranite automated. Um, now I want to go ahead. I think we can make one more of those. Oh, we need, we need, oops. We need one more of these. We've got no, no way to automate them. Okay. And then we need two hoes. Okay. So we place this here ether so this is west oh my gosh you can push it into this one that means i can go like that oh wow so we only need one to have it they link up with each other oh my huh that's how quickly you get it huh okay well, let's go make sure that thing is chunk loaded. Oops. Okay. Let's do 3G. Okay, so the chunk I'm in. Yeah, this is okay. So we did end up building it in within one chunk, which is good. I'm going to put a wall around it so that nothing accidentally wanders in there. Especially me. 
Okay, so now we're good. It's been encased. It's in there. It's chunk loaded. We don't have to worry about it anymore. Turn off those. That turned out really good. It's all contained in there. He's chilling. And it's going to be far away from enough from our base so that it's not going to be hitting us with all the crazy things. All the crazy doodads. So we are gaining ether gas, but that's just one running. Yeah, that is so, so much faster. That's so cool. That's what we could do. Um, do this. Yeah, and that'll put that'll put the that essence in there. Oh, or will it? No, it's not. Okay. We turn that into a double decker. Okay, so we go like this. Get some uranite. Put it on top. Get some fertilized essence. Put it on bottom. And then the locking. Okay, we lock it in. Place it here. Do some of that, and there we go. Both of those are in there. Now let's get a void upgrade so that we can void the overflow. And then we'll do one of these. And there we go. These two are now pumping out some crazy urinite. And we're not getting it because we weren't doing that. Let's do it faster. There we go. Oh. Shoot, um, let me grab that, put a filter in there, take those, put those back. So now only the uranite can go in, good. Nice, cool, so we got the hydro, hydropic beds right there. Very good. And that's gonna wrap up the episode for today, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Today we set up the ether collection from The Wither. If you guys liked it, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle, and I'll see you all in the next video. Take care, peace out, bye-bye.